Now you might be asking, what about a liquid first stage? To model that, no, no liquid is going to have very large hunks of debris following it. So we're keeping the maximum debris size to a half a foot, which is probably a little bit large. That's a uh, one foot diameter. Uh, this is not steel. I am just modeling uh, SRB material, the propellant at a, a one foot diameter and uh, it's not burning so these uh, debris pieces are not going to decrease in size and I'm saying uh, in this case the upper uh, the rockets either going to stay together or fall apart there's no such thing as the upper stage falling off with max dynamic pressure air loads and the SRB surviving like it did in uh, Columbia or Challenger rather so in this case I'm saying it's going to keep thrusting at one and a half G's uh, for three seconds, and this is probably pretty generous because the max dynamic pressure, the post-abort, chances are the uh, liquid stage is going to go out of control and be destroyed by air aerodynamic pressures much sooner than that. And so keep in mind we don't have large hunks of SRB propellant coming after us. Uh, it falls apart as I'm modeling one half foot radius propellant. And let's see what happens. All right, here's our liquid stage. Oh, and this is again the regular last, the 9,000 foot last. Big difference here. You see the debris is slowing down because it's no big chunks. Drogue opens. And keep in mind, this stuff is not burning either. These are just pieces of metal, so there's no radiant heat coming after our chute. And we could easily pop open the main at this point, 40 seconds into the sim. And that's at 700 pounds per square foot dynamic pressure. Now let's look at the effect of debris size on escape. We've increased the maximum debris size to 3 feet radius at 6 feet across. I think that's perfectly reasonable for a large SRB coming apart to have six foot diameter pieces. This is the uh, direct or shuttle like uh, dynamic pressure, 700 PSF. And let's see what happens. There's Orion chased by the big debris. And some of those are little debris. You see they're falling to the wayside. The drug opens. This is 24 seconds into the abort. And we are at in the debris field with a 4,000 degree burning debris. And this is with the large launch abort system with the 80,000 pound sustainer and a three second high G for a total of 22,652 pounds. And uh, this was also with just a uh, 3G SRB XL which is probably a little on the low side and a three second time to destruct. Not a good day for uh, getting off an SRB.